Seeing no further introductions, it is now time for members' statements. The member from Carleton, Mississippi Mills. Mr. Speaker, today I rise in the House to raise awareness among Ontarians about one of the cruelest moments in the history of humanity, the deportation of Crimean Tatars from Crimea in 1944, orchestrated by Joseph Stalin. Under the false accusations of collective collaboration between Crimean Tatars and the Nazis, the Soviet government evicted over 240,000 Crimean people from their homeland in order to destroy them as an ethnic group. Within months, half of them died of cold, hunger, exhaustion and disease. After the illegal annexation of Crimea by Russia in 2014, the Crimean Tatars have been facing a new wave of violence and hatred. Their national leaders are banned from entering Crimea. Dozens of people were imprisoned during and shortly after the annexation, and many others are still missing. Mr. Speaker, I would like to reaffirm my support for Canada's position on this issue. As Prime Minister of Canada, the Right Honourable Stephen Harper said last spring, Canada will never recognize this annexation as being the genuine will of the Ukrainian people. Crimea is Ukraine, Mr. Speaker. Let us not forget the victims of the Soviet regime. Let us not allow such atrocities to happen again in the future. Slava Ukraini. Thank you. Her statement, the member from Hamilton, Stony Creek.